Right. Hopefully you can see this a bit better. Right, and if I knock it, hang on, how am I going to do this? Ready? It is absolutely soaking in here. Right, I've just cut that out of the ridge because the felt was going right the way along there. So as you can see there's bits of felt down there that I've cut out. And you can see how much water's been dripping. It's dripping all the time I'm in here. It's actually like a bloody rainforest. <coughs> um, it's vented down there. Now it was freezing last night. And I think that's what's caused this. I've put another layer of insulation in this attic, but I don't think it's going to help because there is no airflow on this side of the roof. This is obviously adjoining next door, so this is an ender terrace. Um, the only place there isn't any condensation is the lower half because there's no airflow. Well, there is air, there's not airflow. Air can get in, but it can't circulate, so it'll only come in so far with them vents down there. What it needs to do is be able to travel around the roof and it'll now hopefully get out through there it is a, a dry ridge system that's on there but if it's a dry vented ridge system is there such a thing i don't know but what i could probably do with is putting some tile vents in here to try and cut this down because i mean it's not even got cold last night but this was the first frosty night we've had this year so this house is in glasgow um and it hit freezing last night but yeah the importance of uh, look at it hmm. 